Yoshi. So I'm kind of just like doing this like on the fly. All right, so here we're going, going into loser's quarterfinal here, folks. Starting on Pokemon Stadium. Um, I would say Raptor is a bit more of the offensive type of player here. Uh, out of the two out of the uh, two Yoshis we have here, Suarez and uh, and Raptor, of course. So, let's see, Nair, down air. I think the mentality of Pac-Man, strangely enough, works very similarly to the Pac-Man to the mentality of other characters like Robin or Zelda. A lot of it is you want to be able to set up your traps. You want to be able to set up your ideal game plan. And Yoshi is a very disruptive character in that regard because he pretty much just dinosaur brain jumps up in your face and causes you problems. Okay, I can, I can see that definitely happening. I think I think the major thing right now is that he, yeah, is that Raptor's going to try and like pop that, that uh, Hydra a lot. So I think Sinji... Especially from his last matchup against Zero to None, he's ready for people ready to pop that uh, Hydrant. So he's just going to kind of play on, like, a counter play, I guess. I do like where he's putting the Hydrant, though. Because if you pay close attention, he's putting the Hydrant under, under the platform while he's also on the other side of the platform, essentially creating a bunker for himself to just set up whatever he wants because that helps protect him from... Uh, Raptor's eggs that helps protect him from a frontal assault. And it's just a really smart place to keep putting that Hydra. Yeah. Along with that, like, he kind of, and along with that, he's not even, like, using too much, like, of, like, advanced options, not advanced complex options here. He's just kind of just throwing the projectiles through and through. And let's see, side B, try to get something started here. Oh, wow, use the double, burns the double jump armor, 86% on Raptor. Again, underneath that platform, notice that. And... Okay, here comes the bell. And again, getting hit with Another the bell. Thing. Oh, wow. That was such a useful tool in attacking this kid. Big time, and Sinji at 128% here. Still on his first stock, so he can just, he doesn't have to go in as much. You know, Raptor, I like the patience on the guy, but right as I say patience, he starts rushing in with a couple of fares here. Gets, tries to get the Nair, but okay, good stuff. Managed to, to clock him out with the uh, with the back air. That's going to be getting that bunker set up. Wow! Just look at that pressure just from the apples and such. There's just junk flying everywhere there. You had the hydrant, you had the apple, you had the Pac-Man's foot. Okay. Shield looking pretty small for Sinji, so a lot of uh, Yoshi's... Uh, again, here we go. This time, Raptor actually running away from the options, just choosing not to have any of it. And he's... Again, look at how, like patient now Raptor's playing because he because he sees that Sinji has the bell if Sinji gra hits him with that bell it's that's we're going to game two okay the strawberry drop actually messing him up Here comes the melon 109 percent switching it over to the bell not yeah. getting the combo he really wanted off that oh yeah 120 percent though on Raptor 52 percent on Sinji they trade jumps away and, okay, good forward air. 91%. Eat. I, like, I, there's yeah. a... Mo that looks to be the biggest problem with the bell, though, is most of the time, in order to get the really big advantage off of it, you need to be able to grab it after you throw it. Yeah. And the bonus fruit are only around for such a short time that... If Raptor can disrupt that even just a little bit, Sinji's approach, yeah. then you can just keep you can basically play keep away and not let him get the bell. And but that's a victory bell right there for Sinji. Yep. Alright, so Sinji manages to take game one um, with a lot of momentum with a lot of momentum on his side right there. Act managing to get a lot of the bell bell confirms. Running it back to stadium. I don't know how I feel about this. Um, I could just be like a comfort pick. I also Sinji could have probably banned uh, Triplats, uh, Battlefield, and Yoshi's Story because that messes up. Like it, it. While you know he is playing the bunker style with the uh, platforms and such, that just the idea of top platform is just going to mess uh, Pac-Man up with any of his projectiles. So just not as much room to run around and throw projectiles. Also, so I can see I can see Sinji banning triplats 
and no one wants to go. And that also leaves Lilat on the field, but no one wants to go to Lilat. Right, but Smash is also an option and also Final Destination, which both of those, I mean, yes, Sinji could technically bunker on Smashville, but Smashville is a lot smaller of a stage, and bunkering in the center of the... The center platform is going to be a bit harder. Yeah, it's um, not as advantageous as just kind of hanging out on the side of the stage like we're yeah. seeing here with PS2. I think I think it's just like I said, it's just a, a comfort pick for uh, for uh, Raptor also because you know we're always on PS2. It's pr probably one of the most balanced stages as a starter. Like, so it could just be a, like a comfort pick, but sometimes you have to you gotta look away from the comfort and look at more like the statistics, not the statistics, but like what could possibly happen. And with with PS2, why why I prefer Ooh. PS2 as a uh, as enough a, of a dunk. As a pack, as a former Pac-Man, is that there's a lot of room to run around with. There's a lot of like ways to play around with the platforms and such. And Sinji's taking full advantage of that. And another bell confirm. And Sinji still in the driver's seat, almost gets clipped by the by the hydrant. Good stuff on Raptor trying to get something started here. <laughs> and the hydrant not being too friendly to Sinji there. The way the hydrant interacts with all of the bonus fruit is the weirdest thing. And if you understand that as a Pac-Man player, you have my complete respect. Oh, man, it was fun. Like, literally how I describe playing Pac-Man is you got to play chess when your opponent's playing checkers sometimes. Like, that is actually, like, sometimes how I felt. All right, up throw. Try to get the up air, but he's just out of that percent for it. Trying to catch Raptor sleeping. The roll actually messing up Rap uh, the Hydrant messing up uh, Raptor. Yeah, Hydrant's the weirdest water box in the game because a lot of them, a lot of the other water boxes and wind boxes like Mario's Flood or um, Game & Watch or Greninja, most of the time, like, you kind of point those where you want and you're actively trying to place your opponent somewhere else. Yes. With Hydrant, it doesn't feel that way. Hydrant feels like you're dropping it just so that it exists. And okay. then sometimes you just get lucky and they run into the water and it does weird things. Yep. It's it's it's. I think it's based around like when the water like immediately shoots out, like now. Right. Like that's when like the baloney with the wind box happens. And what in the world is this? Is this interaction Raptor with the awareness with the, to use the uh, noggin dunk to try and get something started here? One twenty four percent on Raptor, seventy four percent on Sinji. He's these two are trying to get something started here. Uh, Raptor trying to grab game one. He does not want to go home just yet, but a back throw is going to take it. Ta take him off stage. Ugh. All right, so we got the bell in hand, and, and there we go. Raptor really needs to find, like, an answer for that bell. He, he's gotten literally five out of six of the stocks that he's... A Five out of the five stocks have been because of this bell. Can this you set. jump armor through it? Um, I'm not too sure about that one. I haven't had a, a Yoshi that's gutsy enough to attempt that. <laughs> Maybe that's what he's trying to do. There's a possibility, but like, it hasn't worked the last five times. Uh, that's true. I think he's just catching him sleeping or just catching him looking. And Sinji's just again taking advantage of that. I think he was expecting the roll there. Let me just point out how far away Sinji was with that uh, grab. Yeah, I think he was expecting the roll or so, or something like maybe trying to extend like a like a no. F I mean when uh, Raptor grabbed him, like you could see the tip of uh, Raptor's tongue. I think you could see that Sinji was like five feet away. Oh, dunk! And he goes so far out for that forward air. Yeah, Raptor wants to go in on Pac-Man. He wants to bully the Hydrant away from him. And oh boy. Uh, that's. I think that was not intended. And I think that's. Oh the, no, he's fine. He's fine. He's got the. Re, uh, the no, he doesn't. It. He did not regrab the uh, the bell. And oh my God, this is where Raptor wants to be. Yeah. You want to be in Sinji's face. You don't want to give him the time to get his hydrants, get his spells. You want him out of there. All right. Bell about to get popped. He doesn't. All right. Hydra gets popped. He has an orange. Grabs it back. Double double dipping and trying to go for a th for a snipe. Up, up tilt, up air. Don't stay under him. Yeah, what are you trying to do? You don't land on top of Yoshi. Are you swinging at a Pac-Man shield? That's something you also shouldn't do. He has Melon. It's staying in the air. Nothing there. He get he nullifies it with the egg. Trying to get the, the from the top rope, the missile drop kick from the top rope. But he got the grab? Yeah, he did. You can't spot dodge a Pac-Man grab. I thought he ran through him. No. 
<laughs> oh boy. All right. We're all right. Neutral's been reset. Any anything orange and up is good chance to kill. Apple will 100% kill right now. Melon definitely. Galaxian Bird, probably some sort of confirm that Sinji's about to pull up on here. He's got the bell. He's got bell, so. Yep. All right. He's got the re. He's got Victory the bell again. Up? Nope. Not just yet. Ooh. Strawberry messing him up. Near out of uh, shield looking like Yoshi. Yep. He's back throw's going to do it. Yeah, back throw's going to do it. Raptor was sitting at over 200%. And I'm not, su and I'm not surprised that that takes it here.